Hello, my name is Marnal Prinsler and I lead the Papa Bloemfontein team. In South Africa, we face an unemployment rate of 32.6% and we have the highest income inequality distribution in the world. We have many people who have a matric certificate, but on average, a learner in South Africa tests on a grade 7 level for literacy and on a grade 4 level for numeracy. You might ask, with these realities, how can we face something like poverty and unemployment? As Pop-Up, we dream about cities of wholeness, where hopeless consumers become positive contributors. We do this by walking a journey with each of our learners, starting off with life skills where we address character issues. After that, we place them in a skills program, helping them to grow in their capacity in terms of numeracy, literacy and basic computer skills. We finish off by addressing their competency levels in terms of soft business and technical skills. We hope to place each of our learners either in an entry-level job, per the skills programs or in an enterprise development program. Here are some stories of learners who's been through the journey. Hule was one of our first learners in a pop-up in 2021 when we started out. Uh, Pule comes from a very challenging background. He joined us at Pop-Up Life Skills and uh, I re always remember him as the guy that had a challenge in terms of eyesight and one of our partners helped him uh, to get glasses. And in this process, he met Jesus and his life changed. He did the AET course, he did computer literacy and then in the end, Pule was a new man. He was confident about life and uh, he was, he was full-time employed and building a future for his family. Hey everyone, my name is Pule and my name is Radita and I'm from Bloemfontein. I'm a baker at Daisy Co, which is the place that I got uh, right now as at Pop-Up. So I was looking for a job, I was like I was a student and then things fell apart. Um, someone just took my CV to pop up and then uh, I, I went through the process and then I went to pop up for like three weeks for life skills. So life skills is where they teach you the basics and then um, actually they teach, as well, they teach you how about the Christianity role as well. For someone that want to go to pop up, yo, I would advise you to go. It's a really nice place to go. Like, Besides you be looking for a job, you been looking for like maybe the answers in life, they really help you a lot. Like yeah, they did help me. I was this shy person, I'm so shy though. I was this this shy person who didn't like speak to people. And then we went through the process and then I was good for my side. Like pop up did help me a lot. I'm in class today because of they did. So like I can't see and then they just do their thing. So I don't know what they did, but they did it. So I'm grateful a lot. And for whoever is supporting Pop-Up, I will say, you're literally doing the great job. And then I wish God will bless you guys. When Dr. Dayo takes hands with Pop-Up, it's all about city transformation. When we do life skills, it is that moment where people get to meet Jesus and their lives change. When we help someone to acquire a skill or help them to find employment, it literally changes the fiber of our city. You see, that is what Pop-Up is all about. But what happens if we can't find employment? Do we just give up? No, of course not because we can also create opportunities through enterprise development. We can help people start their own little businesses. We can journey with them and help them to grow and manage these businesses so that they can become contributors to our city. You see, we can create those opportunities. And that is what Pop-Up is gearing up for in 2024. So how can you be part of this? Well, every person that contributes to our generosity fund is in some way helping to actually make this possible. So that is the easiest way. But maybe you also, you own a business or you work at a business that would be willing to take hands with us, to work with us and maybe even invest in Pop-Up to really escalate this to a new level. So I invite you today. 
to speak to us, to contribute with us, to dream with us, and to trust with us that through Pop-Up, we will bring hope to the hopeless people in our city.